Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about the EU ROM, like why this is the best ROM for any Xiaomi phone to use. So guys, let's begin. So as you can see, we, I am using the MIUI 12.5.2 EU version and as compared to the stable room the global stable room the eu room here is far better the animations and everything here is just great it's just smooth and uh, it is just better and it is one of the best room you can use on the poco x2 like if you want a stable experience and use it for a long time and you don't want to change rooms now and then so you can use this room as a daily driver like it's the most stable i am using this from around 15 days now and it's just great this room here is performing just fluid enough and everything just works fine the only issue here is the drm info like though it is showing the widevine l1 as you can see the security level it is showing widevine l1 but uh, this is because i had flashed the rom after the stock rom the previously i was using stock rom and then i had flashed this u rom that is the reason i am getting the widevine l1 support but in the prime video it is just not showing the quality the max quality it is showing here is uh, as you can see the max streaming quality it is showing a 0.46 GB per hour which is not which is only 480p you will not be able to stream HD full HD videos on this room otherwise everything here is just great it's just far better than the stable stock room you can use it just flash this room if you are on Indian stable 12.5 because it's far better and there are far many features in the gallery app and everything as you can see this is these are the features available the video editor you get to see the magic the video effects and everything so these are some great things you get into in the eu rom and the most important thing here is the file manager and everything the system apps you don't get to see any ads or stuff this is the latest file manager app we get to see and as you can see there are no ads available everything just works fine it's fast and fluid and everything here is just great you can go to the there are no lags or stutters as you can see it's just fluid and the app opening speeds are just great and most importantly you will get the 27 watt support which in most custom rooms we are not getting talking about the camera also the camera here just remains the sta same as the global stable room the camera works perfectly fine the you get to see the anx cam and if you want to shoot videos it is just great to shoot videos with the anx cam it's just great for videos and the gcam here also just works perfectly fine as you can see the room here is just pretty much stable and i am just very much impressed with this room you can use it as a daily driver so if you are using a global stable i would suggest you to switch over to the this room the eu 12.5 stable or you can also switch to eu beta but beta has more bugs this is stable and it has almost no bugs everything just works fine on this room the app opening speed the battery backup on this room here is also just good i'll show you so the battery backup here is just great you will get around four to five hours of screen on time at 120 hertz display the 120 hertz display on this room here is just working fine you also get to see the app op closing animations the unlocking animations as you can see these are all the great stuff available in this room which you don't get in the global stable which has the poco launcher then another issue here is with the banking apps if you are using banking apps like the google pay so while you when you register the number it will just not show that there are no sims or it will not detect the sim card so for that there is a problem fix here just go to the phone about information i'll just show it to you again tap and hold on the banking app then go to app info go to the permissions and uh, here you will see the get device info here it will be like this uh, it will be written blank messages just click on always allow and now you will be able to run the banking apps also so this is the fix for the banking apps in the eu rom if you are using 
otherwise everything just works great you get to see this options the my data the used how much you have used the phone the steps and everything and everything just works fine the screen time the digital well-being you get to see the new ui and everything so you get to see the focus mode so these are some features you get extra in this room otherwise everything here is just same as this global stable that is it for now if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to hit the like button if you are new to this channel then please guys subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions then you can ask me in the comment section below or in the telegram group i'll meet you in the next one till then stay safe have fun and bye